18 Sports from the Williams Honda Sports Desk. The Corning Boys Lacrosse team are back to back sectional champs, and now the Hawks are preparing to go back to the state tournament. Corning won the sectional title with a hard fought 11 to 10 win over Ithaca, and the Hawks know that another tough opponent awaits them in states. Corning is preparing for another big game on the lacrosse field, knowing that there is a lot on the line. When you get to this point, it's, you know, you lose and you go home, and each day is different, you know, so you can't look at this team and that team. You have to just go out, and we're focusing on our team, the Corning Hawks, and doing what we do well, and that's what we've been preaching the last two weeks is let's do what we do well, really well. I mean, we just got to come in, playing hard, and do what we're taught to do and what we're prepared to do, and really just play to our potential and work hard this week in practice. Playoffs are in full swing, and five local athletes came up big in the postseason to earn themselves a nominee for 18 Sports Athlete of the Week. Our first nominee is Brianna Gambrell of Athens. As Gambrell took first place in the long jump at the PIAA Track and Field Championships, winning a state title for the Wildcats. Ian Cook had a big performance for Horseheads in the sectional final, scoring seven goals. For the Blue Raiders, Parker May threw a two-hit shutout and struck out 14 in the sectional win for Notre Dame. Other nominees are Michaela Brzezinski of Bath, who threw a one-hit shutout in a sectional win for the Rams, and Simon Smith of Tawanda, who finished in fifth place at States in the 3,200 meters. To college lacrosse, Maryland and their head coach, Corning native John Tillman, took on Denver. In the national championship game, Denver up 2-1 to one in the first when Wesley Berg shoots and scores to put Denver up 3-1. to one. Back comes Maryland in the second. Brian Cole, he's going to get in front, and he puts it into the net to cut the lead to 5-3. to three. More Denver in the third. It's Berg again with another goal as Denver wins a national championship with a 10 to 5 win over Maryland. The Yankees hosted the Royals this afternoon, no score in the bottom of the first until Chase Hadley launches a two-run homer to right to give New York a 2 to 0 lead. More Yankees in the first two on for Brian McCann, McCann with a three-run homer to right to make it 5 to 0 Yankees still in the first inning. It's Brett Gardner's turn to go yard another three-run homer as the Yankees get a win over the Royals 14 to 1. So the Yankees not wasting a lot of time today. That's true. Thanks so much, Chuck.